ATVs and dirt bikes ripping through the streets of Greensboro. Our cameras caught them in the act several times. People say they're fed up and are urging police to get involved. Tonight, WFMY News 2's Marissa Tancino learned what could happen to them if police catch up with them. You can hear them coming from far away. And oftentimes, they have no place being on the road. They cut through the neighborhood sometimes and be flying up the street doing 50, 60 miles an hour. You know, and it's like it's a 25 mile hour zone, there are kids on the street. Scott Till says he constantly sees ATVs and dirt bikes driving recklessly where they shouldn't be. They came by me and cut me off. I ended up having to lock up my brakes. Greensboro police say ATVs are not street legal. Dirt bikes are allowed on the roads, but they must be registered. The driver has to be licensed and wear a DOT approved helmet. Police have been called on them several times and police always get there right after they're gone. Greensboro police say the calls come in sporadically based on when groups of Riders are out. They want to educate them about the rules of the road, but police will charge those who violate the law. I want it to be stopped. I mean, because it's not right. You know, they shouldn't be allowed to do it. Police say riders who break ATV and dirt bike laws could be charged with different traffic violations depending on how they're riding and how fast.